Hey, hello, second grade. This is Mr. McAuliffe coming to you once again from your classroom here at St. Margaret's Elementary School. You know, the last couple of weeks when I've read a story to you, uh, I've had so much fun doing it that it's something that I want to continue to do. Uh, just like we used to do every Monday afternoon after lunch when I would read to you. So we're going to keep doing this um, each week. And this week I've picked a, a, another book for you. It's a little bit different book. Um, I know you guys in second grade already know your ABCs. Uh, but this is a little bit different ABC book. So if you're sitting down, you might want to stand up because... Uh, part of this book is to act out some things and to do some things um, that you're going to need to be able, that you're going to need to stand up to do. So the title of this book is called Action ABCs, and it is an ABC book, and you know your ABCs, I know that. But as we go through each letter, I'm going to ask you to do some things that you're going to have to be ready to do. So Action ABCs, words by Ken Mitchell. And drawings by N.L. Mitchell. That's the author and the illustrator. A is for apple. Why, yes, it is. But the letter A is also for applaud. Show me how you applaud. So after each letter, I'm going to pause for a few seconds to give you time to do whatever that letter is asking you to do. B is for ball. Why, yes, it is. But the letter B is also for balance. Can you show me how you balance? C is for cat. Why, of course it is, but the letter C is also for count. Show me how you count. The letter D is for duck. Why, yes it is, but the letter D is also for dance. Show me how you dance, second grade. Letter E is for elephant. Why, of course it is. But the letter E is also for exercise. Can you show me how you exercise? F is for feet. Why, yes it is. But the letter F is also for frown. Can you show me how you frown? G is for goldfish. Why it is? Yes, it is. But the letter G is also for grin. Can you show me how you grin? H is for horse. Why, yes, it is. But the letter H is also for hug. Show me how you hug. You can give a air hug. I is for igloo. Why, yes it is. But the letter I is also for inhale. Can you show me how you inhale? J is for juice. Why, of course it is. But the letter J is also for jump. Can you show me how you jump? K is for kite. Why, yes it is. But the letter K is also for kiss. Show me how you kiss. L is for lion. Why, of course it is. But the letter L is also for laugh. Show me how you laugh. M is for mouse. Why, yes it is, 
But the letter M is also for march. Show me how you march. N is for nose. Why, yes it is. But the letter N is also for nod. Show me how you nod. O is for orange. Why, yes it is. But the letter O is also for oink. Show me how you oink. Bet Alexander is good at this one. P is for pear. Why, yes it is. But the letter P is also for paddle. Show me how you paddle. Like paddle a boat? Q is for queen. Why, yes it is. But the letter Q is also for quack. Show me how you quack. R is for robot. Why, yes it is. But the letter R is also for run. Show me how you run. Coach Frank would like this one. S is for star. Why, yes it is. But the letter S is also for smile. Show me how you smile, second grade. I miss all those smiles out there. The letter T is for turtle. Why, yes it is. But T is also for twirl. Show me how you twirl. U is for umbrella. Why, yes it is. But the letter U is also for uncover. Show me how you uncover. V is for violin. Why, yes it is. But the letter V is also for vacuum. Show me how you vacuum. W is for watermelon. Why, yes it is. But the letter W is also for wave. Show me how you wave, second grade. <clears throat> the letter X is for xylophone. Because X is always for xylophone. Y is for yo-yo. Why, yes it is. But the letter Y is also for Yawn! Show me how you yawn, second grade. Z is for zebra. Why, yes it is. But the letter Z is also for zigzag. Show me how you zigzag. I hope you enjoyed this week's story, second grade, as much as I enjoyed reading it to you. It's a little bit different book because we have to act out what the letters, um, what the letters are. So I hope that you enjoyed that. I miss you, second grade, and I look forward to the day when you're sitting in front of me here in your classroom once again, and I'm reading to you with you here. But until that time, make sure that you Listen to your moms or dads or grandmas or grandpas or whoever's helping you with your work at home, your schoolwork. Uh, please remember to do your schoolwork and make sure that uh, you get it back to you, Mrs. Clark, so that she knows how well you're doing. Until next time, boys and girls, be safe, be healthy, and be strong. Bye-bye, second grade.